Hello, Horace here with another episode of the Octavian Empire campaign for Total War Rome 2. And last time we all but eviscerated Lepidus holdings in ready for battle. the area of Iberia. The third Rapax is ready to come to the defense of Taraco along with the Classis 1 Apollinaris, while we have Octavian across over in Tingus, consolidating his position here, and then we shall move north with this army to Cordoba, and hopefully the Iberians will not take Toledo, but I'm not holding out much hope for that. The Fourth Equestris, the one other legion Lepidus has up here, is holding up and garrisoning the city after taking it last turn. And it looks like he's taken enough damage to where I doubt he's going to be able to hold off against the Heralds of Etikina. So we'll see how that goes. Let's also keep in mind that it has been a while since we noticed what Antony was doing. I'm more than a little apprehensive as to what he might have in store for me. Now, nope, the Legion has abandoned Toledum and is marching towards Cordoba. Which is fine, because now I can move I can move Octavian up, and I'm pretty sure Iberia will take Toledo. The Cheruski are eliminating the last of the Gauls, which is fine with me. I really want to take that area of Northern Gaul anyway, so that's a, a My lord good would have so. me propose a treaty between us. I will go further Not and hunt that one. Let's keep him out of the war, as long as we can anyway. The Numidians are probably going good for me here shortly, especially after I invade. Okay, let's see. Yep, Toledo taken. Invalidated. Oh well. That's your command. Let's see if we can't make this a hard point, shall we? Any man who drops out right, first off. Behind. Can we come to the defense of Cordoba at this point? Waiting for more orders. Believe it or not, we can actually get in the city. I don't know how that's possible, because it was definitely showing that I couldn't, so... Odd, but whatever. I don't know if uh, that's something that's specific to what's happening right now. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're going to go with it. Um... We can now relieve the siege here. Ready for, for death and honor! And the 8th Venaria under Publius Babudius Marcellus is about to be eliminated by Scapula. Tell them all! Third Rapex. Not even worth fighting. Uh, not even worth fighting. Yeah! Yeah! Cool. Marcellus is gone, and with him, an entire legion of left. Their audacity and their crimes against the Roman Republic, they are enslaved. At once! At your command! You are no longer Latin citizens. We will march... Actually, no. Let's see. I guess I should probably try to reach Saguntum, which is fine. We should be able to get there, no problem. I got a lot of places can upgrade into uh, little extra income, and I'm actually going to do it just because we need the extra income and there's no public order penalties for a tier 1 industry building, which is good for me. Meanwhile, we'll continue marching across Southern Gulf. That will work. That will 
will work indeed. Let us change this. Because that gives me plus two to public order. I need more than that. I also need better control over Latium. Um, well, from all sources. So Jupiter is getting a temple at Tinius. Good for them. Brindisium. Could do that. Let's see what else we got that I can put in. Um, I'm feeling the cohort there here. Oh, ah. there we go, specialized. The Ala Pandoniorum Equitae is the Cohorts 3, Alpinorum and the Cohorts 2 Gilorum. There are some extra units, very unique units. We have Auxilia Cohorts, and Auxilia Infantry. So yeah, once we get that going, we'll eliminate these mercenaries, we'll build up an actual force there, we'll get rid of the Germans. So, yeah. Could march farther towards the Guntum, but I really don't. Well, I don't know. They might be within striking range. I don't think so, actually. And I don't think I can actually reach them. I mean, that's kind of. kind of. gambling, and I'd rather hold up in Cordoba, choke this off, make them go backward. Hunting down Lepidus in Iberia, the last remnants of his imperial forces there are going to die. Yep, and he's running back towards the coastline. All of his forces are withdrawing back to Africa. garrison our Iberia with these forces. I will send them back on a fleet and sail them. I humbly propose back towards our province in Sicily. Send the third rat packs to Gaul as well. We'll begin our offensive against the Cheruski. I want to knock them out. They dared fight against the might of the Republic. And they sully the name of Caesar, taking their territory that traditionally should be mine. Commander. Won by my uncle. Go ahead and march this. Force march continues. I want to get my military machine up and running. Won't be easy. Achilles. Alright. That's where we're at. I'm gonna send my spy back here so we don't in uh, initiate an incorrigible relationship with Iberia as of right now. Bird keeps on my good list. We'll sail back towards Ivasim. That should work. <laughs> Luigi. 
regions of Octavian have one Iberia. Lepidus needs to leave now. Hopefully we can flush him off into the ocean. If so, I'm going to take my... Ah, ha, 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 okay. Let's see what you're doing there. Cute. Well, by the time they get to any of the cities down there, with the exception of Gaddis, the garrison should be able to make them beat themselves against the walls. I propose. Oh. We got no problem getting defensive alliances with those tribes. Traditionally, those weren't part of the Roman Empire until well into the second century AD, and even then, they were just nominally in charge. You know? Ultimately, we'll want to get them to be client states because that did occur. Okay, Ibasen. Okay, nothing fancy there. Something fancy there, though. So we'll do that. Again, though. Alright. And if awesome, we will do a villa. Lots and lots of villas. And it doesn't seem to raise. Well, I guess it's because it's winter. It doesn't really look like it's raising anything, but I may be wrong. Okay, that doesn't really get me anything. That, Vertigala, good enough. Actually, here we have the Ala Galorum Equites, the Cohors 1, Octanorum, Veterana, and the Auxiliary Noble Horse, which we wanted to get to command. begin with. At once. Cool. Well, with the extra funds we get from that, that we're going to recruit a few. There's the Ala Galorum Equites, which are medium cav, it looks like. Melee cav, anyway. Yeah, their melee attack's pretty dang decent. Auxiliary cav's about the same, though. There's the noble horse, which is crazy good. And we have the cohorts one, Aquatinorum Vedrana. Which is one of the auxiliary regiments. We also have Gallic Hunters, that we can get. Looks like we don't have the uh, required initial uh, attack for the Imperial Auxiliary Cohorts yet, but that's fine. Apparently we can still see them. That's kind of odd. So, we're gonna do a unit of them. Rome needs good fighters. A couple of units of those. That should flesh out the Alude and get me some good units out of that. That may rebel. If it does, so be it. And here's what we're doing with Caesar. That's something cute. Waiting for more orders. right outside of the area there, and Gaddis will be alright. They can't come across to attack here, which I'm fine with. Looks like Antony's still got some problems with some rebellions in this land, so he's going to be preoccupied when we're going to war with me, which, again, not so concerned by. I'd prefer it if he did that. Lepidus is breaking out the agents. Oh, and he just failed. That legion is stuck. Can't go to sea without being annihilated by my fleet. It can't go north without being hit by my legion. Its fate is sealed. Its fate is sealed. Aha! There's a Cheruski army up here. If we can get our legionary forces up there to Lamonum in time, we should be able to hold off. The skill invasion. of your general. We'll not go to Numidia, not yet. Aha, they tried to go. That's actually very uh, brave. But futile. Ready 
ready, willing, and able. Increase public order, cultural history. Good. Uh huh. I see what you did. At once, your next Very command. Well. Assassinate him. I don't really have good chances, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Good. That'll do. Marching in to eliminate him. We will Get on watch. patrol, increase a little bit on that. Corrales looks pretty good, actually. Uh, we could probably use a little more of that. Why not? Up here, we're going to march all the way to the Monum. Or we will assist in protecting against forces of the Cheruski, which are coming in mass. Cohort Spare at Lamonum will build because we need it. Massilia is looking good now. Medulanum is looking good now. We still got Bibracti, Misanto, and uh, Trevorum. We can build that up. We'll get a great temple to Mars in this place. So, we got a lot going on over here in the west. How goes the war in the east? He hasn't really expanded much, it looks like, although I can't really see anything over here. Uh, Hatra is under Antony. We have no idea about anything else around here. So, he does have this province, but Tessaphon looks like it may be in the hands of the Parthians still. So, fair enough. The Marco Manny... Do not attempt to speak in truth with honey. No. Okay then. I'm not offering you money, for crying out loud. The Cheruski have lost all their territory across from across the Rhine, so they've actually completely migrated into the lands of Gaul, which is interesting and not all that unbelievable. Well met, friend. Satan let your words... Yeah, I didn't think so. So, that's going on. The door is open to you. You don't want... All right, then. That's fine. My master oh, extends the most nope. magnificent welcome... About the Maori. Please Maori be seated Maybe. and take. Okay. May the God. How about you? The you pleasures of my household no. are yours. That's fine. We'll have the Maori as our ally for the time being. Technicolored map. I don't know if that's actually showing up in the recording when it does that, but it's glitchy right there. Alright. Well, yeah, like so I think we're ready to move on, that's about all we can do. I don't like the fact that Iberia definitely still controls the majority of territory in the Iberian Peninsula. This bothers me for a number of reasons. Defensively, it doesn't make sense. I can't just keep a single garrison legion in that province and hope that it'll all work out. Because if they declare war on me while I'm in the middle of the civil war preoccupied in the West, our offer is fair and honorable. By the you don't get military access to an empire, and I don't like you. Guy Tui, I didn't give you military access. That is not okay. Sentia looks to be a Castra now, so that's cool. And 
next one will get me uh, a new legion built there, which will be useful. With Nizium, we can still do stuff. We're going to do Shrine of Neptune, just because. Praetoria is still building, as it should. We'll get that set up there, and that set up there. Definitely don't have enough money for anything else, but that's still very good, very good, and very useful. All right. Come on up. This may go horribly awry, but we're gonna do that. They gotta go through Babrakti in order to get down here to Gergovia, or they gotta go back around to Lamona. If they do, they should trigger the second Alude out of uh, Ambush Stance, which is gonna be nice. We're also going to... move out of Trevorum. We're gonna go dark. The idea being, we're going to pincer out this territory in Gaul, eliminate that massive army of the Cheruski, and in doing so, stop their threat in the north, I hope. We hunger for victory! It's a bad idea. Third rat packs, eliminate them. spy cross we're also going to move Octavian here along with the fleet we will board the fleet then we shall sail so legions are away and they're now ready to begin our invasion of North Africa in earnest Peace in the West, I hope. Let's see what we can do about this. Be welcome. Come you on, have my right. full attention. No. Our haggling Come on. must, I think, continue a little longer. There you go. Truly, my good. And while we're at it, military access. Please be seated and take wine you'll, you'll to cool me. the head before we hit the day with words. Aww. You have an honest face. <laughs> Even as you offer an honest bribe. Honest bribe. Truly, my good That's and noble friend, your kind words and... Speak your speech so that trade. I may go to the bar. Fine. Well, you're getting hurt, so there's that. Lepidus. Speak your terms. Give words plentiful haste. And Never presume on our noble and... Emotions of looking like I'm trying to get peace with them. Keep placating them up. So I can tell myself. Okay, that was his turn. Can't remember what all's on the turns. It seems so long. Ah. Okay. Garrison in it. These are all very garrisoned military buildings. 
Your men will turn the enemy. Not doing it, Iberia. Not doing it. Grippa is back. It's your command. I think I'm actually gonna put Agrippa in charge of the first Concordialis. Boston. Alright, so I'm losing. Losing some uh, strength in the Senate, thanks to the fact that it looks like I've got enemies in a province. Which bothers them, apparently. Let us go to the general and replace him with Agrippa. Higher. Yep. There he goes. Octavian is in route back to Rome, so we'll put him in charge of the Praetorians when we get that up and going. That will be good. Nothing there. Six legionaries. This will hold out for two turns. Never mind, we're not gonna get there in time. We have got to march like mad. Your next command. Command. Let's see if we can take some pressure off of them, shall we? for more orders. Actually, you know what? Ready for battle. Yeah. Let's raid. Let's raid. Do what we can. See if we can get a rebellion going on in this land. Maybe push them back, because I don't think they're going to like it. going on here. They're consolidating in Carthage. Good for them. It isn't going to matter one click, but... So be it. Eh, yeah, we'll send the rat packs over here towards the Rhine frontier. We will. Is March that here. all? To battle! Yep. 
destroy that. Good job. We didn't lose hardly a thing, so that. You have awesome. further orders. Volker, pretty boy, Claude. Literally. Well, pretty boy anyway. I guess I don't know what his first name is, but. Do tactics. Send him into the city. Garrison that. We're also gonna build Mars up and Jupiter. And yeah, that's pretty much what we can do. I think. Two more turns there, so I probably ought to save my money for a little bit so we get a good force set up. Looks like it anyway. Fair enough. We are preparing for. Ready for orders. Look to the defenses. Defense of the forces of uh, Sicily is. They're gonna have a rebellion, of course. Join your mighty strength! Still trying to get me to go to war with Numidia. I don't have a problem if you go to war with Numidia, but leave me out of it. Okay, enormous. It's like Pompeian supporters. Fair enough, we'll eliminate them. More Castra. Building up. We will also move up to here. This looks like a good spot. time to get a fleet over here, but whatever. We're gonna let that churn up for another turn before we do something. Just cause we wanna knock the public order back up a little bit better. I think. And speaking of which, we should probably see if there's a building or something we can put there. No, of course not. And that would explain why we're having the problem we're having with public order. I mean, look at that. All these industrial buildings and agricultural buildings. I wanna keep them. But good grief. It takes five turns for that. I think we're gonna knock the delicatessen in the computer. We got to. Otherwise we'll just keep churning out these rebellions. And I can't keep having that. So Lepidus is holding his forces in Africa. He's lost all of his Iberian possessions. In 
fact, I think that's him and that one leading to the south of Carthage. You are strong and wise, and yet... Man, they want me to go to war with Numidia. Why? Don't worry, eventually I'll liquidate you. Jerusky and Gaul. Now at peace. I have no idea how. Uh, good omen. Alright. Keeper of the auspice, auspice chickens informs us that the birds have eaten heartily, a sure sign that we are favored of the gods, or by the gods. We must celebrate! Woo! Okay. Praetorian. Yep, the cast for Praetoria is finished. So, before we deal with anything else, here we go with the cast for Praetoria. Praetorian's a Praetorian calf. So, Octavian, raise an army. Ready for orders. Outside of the city. What special ancillary do you have? Plus two to morale for auxiliary units. We need something better than that. A flagrum, a Fustus, Gladius, Gallic Bard. Actually, not bad, but. Armor for all units. Ah, come back. Authority, mercenary hiring, plus two to morale for all units. Another one drinking companion, not very Octavian. Shield bearer, heroic hastus executioner. Praetorian guard. That only gives plus one. Cunning, are you kidding me? Ah, uh, we'll do it because it's Praetorian Guard, why not? Okay. Praetorian Cav, one, two. Come! Fight for and they're expensive. Uh, one, two, three. One, two. Three. One, one two, three. So far, that's what we got. We do not have the capacity to build up Eagle cohorts there, but we will do something about that. This will be our Praetorian army, the 6th Fulminata. Commander. Meanwhile, to trade with Orm, you go, 3rd Rapax. Well, here. Go here. Fifth pretensus. Oh yeah, not even worth it. That's a lot of casualties, but hey, this is a minor war, not our big war. This is a civil war series. I could have looted that, but man. I see. And that's the end of the Cheruski. Like that. <laughs> wow. Their hold over Northern Gaul. Ready for orders. That's crazy. Who'd have thought it? Just like that. Wow, so Yulio Banda. Let's see if we can get a position with Gull here. Welcome, worthy friend. No. Let us break bread and drink and ale before access. words pass and our lips. Military Alliance. Okay. Something like that. Free access and defensive lines. And pay me. No 
I mean, we're not done with the episode yet, but just making a note, we're doing all right. We've almost conquered all of Gull, which is huge. That's going to be an income maker, not to mention uh, pull up against Germanic incursion on the Rhine. I don't think I moved them. Whoops. <laughs> oh, well. Maybe I can quickly detour and crush that fleet that's over there. Might be a good idea. Yeah, they hired a few new units, so the Cheruski are trying futilely to survive. They're going to fail miserably. That's how fast fortunes of war can change. They were a force that completely destroyed Gaul. And in the period of an episode, they are going to cease to exist. Ah, uh, that's rumors. Against Speculus, do nothing. Be fine. Last long into the night, both gods and men are pleased. People with prodigious headaches struggle to return to their work the next morning. Yay, everybody's got a hangover. It's totally what we were going for. I don't know how that makes everybody happy. I guess it's for the night party, not the other issue. Probably better knock that out now. At your command. To battle. March. Wipe them out. Wow. Well, we don't have much choice. We gotta eliminate it. I'm not gonna fight that out. We've had enough Pompey and Pompey fights. We're gonna kill those the rebels. Moon. We hunger for battle. Eliminate the rebels. And then we're going to march back over this way. You have further orders? Yep, one more turn and that gets back in shape. Slowly building that up. Very good. Their wrath axe is now up here with the grip up. Alright, we need to send Baro to eliminate that. has trade, Doria Torum, and Doria Retum, I should say, will be the one that gets that. Uh, we're just gonna make another villa in Kinnava. Goal is gonna be a rather fancy place. March. Is that all? Ah, we're just gonna march. It's worse than happen. Yeah, I said it. Ready for orders. <laughs> Hold there for another turn yet. Novum's working on it. But that all looks pretty good. Okay, some extra forces there. Same here. Let's see, we have that. Yes! Yeah, we 
can't really reach him, so we're just gonna have to ignore him. Row, row, row. Which is That's fine it. with me. We'll ignore him. Yeah, no problem ignoring him. Spy will go over here. Begin doing its thing. While we move this lady. Wow. You really can't move at all, can you? It's because of that forward area. I'm actually gonna overshoot Carthage. I'm gonna hit down the coastline and march my way up from over here at Machamedes and just roll up to Carthage. Uh, should make them freak out a little bit and also I think be a good a good end result. Yeah, we're getting some more food coming in. We need it. Do need it. So Here's what's going on. I have a feeling if I eliminate Lepidus completely, or I'm about to, Anthony will declare war on me. I may be wrong. Maybe he's preoccupied not having a good day, but... I have a feeling that's probably what's going to happen. Because he'll sense now's his chance, it's now or never. He's got to, just for survival, build the clear war. Ah, you... Ugh. This magna and the like soon. That's your command. Good. That's a good sign. Ready for battle. You may as well get comfy. Fortify. We hunger for battle. So our force here needs to gain a little more. going to send this force to the top of my thing. Seems likely to be the end scenario there. And once again, we're going to save our money, considering, for the most part. I mean, we're going to do this, because we really need to. Kanabum. The alarming settlement. gonna save my money and yet look there it goes. It's <laughs> pretty much the end of that. That's your command. Let's see what these units look like here. We have the cohorts to Galore. Um comes from Gull. Ends up in Britannia at Hadrian's Wall. So why am I able to, I guess because it was originally, I mean it says that it was datable to 99 in Wessia Inferior, which is over here, in just north of Greece. But, I'm recruiting it in Gaul? I'm guessing. I don't, and then stationed in Mauritania down here, and then it moved up here to Britannia. Interesting. I, I guess because it says Galorum in the name, it comes from Alla Pannoniorum Equites, obviously from Pannonia, which is right here, and, um, uh, yeah, they're melee cab, essentially auxiliaries. And the Cohors III Alpinorum, which is an auxiliary unit of spear infantry from the Alpine, uh, Gallic provinces, so Cisalpine and Transalpine Gaul. 
That's what I'm gonna say anyway, it seems likely. So yeah, there, there's that. <laughs> Which, that's fine. As it is, it's a pretty good garrison there now. Two legionary uh, cohorts, a veteran legionary cohort, Vigiles, plebs, and a Signani unit, two levies. It's not great, but it's good. Come on uh, third rat packs, we're going to get rid of those guys. And those guys. We don't need them. And we'll get the are you ready to serve Rome? Ala Pannoniorum and Rome! Eh, we'll go for the Gilorum cohorts too. Why not? It's a good auxiliary unit. So that's done. One more turn there. This will probably be the last turn for the game today, as we're approaching our hour. lost their position, and Midia has taken it. That's a problem. A very terrible problem. Mar, you're gone. Of course. Continue training the third rat packs. Continue converting the people to Roman Latin culture, which they're doing a really good part of. The Bracti and Basanto have great temples, Canabum. Doria Retum. Wow, I actually said it right. Cool. <laughs> there, we have hurting grounds. So, cool. Ready for battle. Make haste, men. Ready for orders. We hunger for battle. Your next command. that going on. Eventually we'll wrap up the Prizi across the Rhine, which is what I want to do. I got three legions over here, so that should be doable. I hope. And next time we will get our last turn to get our new legionary named cohorts and begin building them, I think. At least in theory. Moving them down. Continue moving them down. Uh, Pagula. Ah, uh, you can move a lot now. Up this magna. Nothing in it. So I think this is all very weak, and we should easily be able to wrap up towards this. Although the first Herculia under Lepidus himself is garrisoned in Carthage. He's gone totally defensive now. Which is fine with me. Um, yeah, so we're not going to spend any more money, I don't believe. We're going to hold here with this force. Definitely got the potential. There's the Eagle Cohort for Legio 3 Augusta right there. So we already got the potential to get some really good units, but at the moment, position on the map is the war in Iberia is over for the time being until the Iberians rebel. The Numidians are on the expansion again in Mauritania. They've destroyed the Maori tribe, subjugating them, and will soon march on the Gaituli, I think. If they do, they'll probably, once eliminating them, go to war against Octavian and uh, try to retake Tingus, because their ultimate goal is to unite all of Western North Africa. Once they do that, they may try to attain empire. Frisia is still an erstwhile neighbor on the Rhine. They've taken Belgica. Uh, the Cherusky are gone, completely.
completely annihilated after settling in northern northwest Gaul after subjugating the Gallic tribes that were under the protectorate of the Roman Republic. They apparently overextended themselves, suffered a rebellion at the same time as invasion, and Octavian's two legions have uh, eliminated them after their failed attempt at Hibrachti. Lepidus is on the defensive. Antony is still engaged in his massive war in against Parthia in the east, and thus not paying attention to what I'm doing, which is fine with me. And Britannia is biding its time, probably consolidating its position over the entire island. So, with all that being said, this is the end of this episode. I will 